little sleepy this morning, not gonna lie to you. I was up late last night. The Last Dance, yes, trending big again overnight. The docuseries bringing fans inside some major Michael Jordan moments. The Dream Team, his relationship with Kobe. Oh my goodness, TJ Holmes is back with us. He's outside Madison Square Garden, one of Jordan's favorite places to play, wasn't it, TJ? Good morning again. It it absolutely was, and folks need to know, it takes a lot to get Robin to stay up late at night. So you know this is a big <laughs> deal, but the yeah. garden here, you, you know how this was a favorite. Michael Jordan averaged more points per game here at the garden than any opponent in history. You know who's number two on that list? Kobe Bean Bryant. Those two guys love this stage, and we saw last night just how much Kobe loved MJ, and it gave us really one of the most heartbreaking and emotional moments of this series so far. Michael Jordan and the record-breaking last dance once again uniting sports fans overnight. This time around moments like these. I'll see you down the road. Cool. The new episodes opened with a tribute to the late Kobe Bryant and featured rare footage. Michael Jordan in the locker room well, talking about taking on the then 19-year-old rising star. I don't believe you going to take everybody on one on Kobe? Yeah. He don't let the game come to him. Mm -hmm. no, he just go out there and take it. We got new insights into Kobe's admiration for MJ from Kobe himself, sharing his respect for the greatest of all time in a new interview filmed before his tragic accident. What you get from me is from him. I don't get five championships here without him because he guided me so much and gave me so much great advice. Fans savored moments like those and other revelations from the hit docuseries as it tracks the rise of Michael Jordan, giving us a look behind the scenes at that Olympic dream team. You can't get too close to Michael, it's a foul. <laughs> and teaming up with filmmaker Spike Lee to make Air Jordan's soar. But behind the scenes, we see Jordan struggle with the spotlight, hounded for his gambling, and at times, tensions rise with teammates, seen in this new footage from next week's episode. So one day, that practice, Phil put Steve Kerr guarding me. We were on opposite sides in a scrimmage, and he's talking all kinds of trash, and I'm pissed because, you know, we're getting our ass kicked. Phil sensed my aggression, but he was trying to tone me down, and he starts calling these tick attack fouls. Now I'm getting mad because for you to be protecting this guy, that's not, it's not gonna help us when we play New York. It's not gonna help us when we play these teams that are very physical. Next time he did it, I just haul off the and I, I said, when I fouled Steve Kerr, I said, now nah, that's foul. I have a lot of patience as a human being, but um, I tend to snap at some point because I'm extremely competitive too. Just not really good enough to back it up usually. But I'm going. I'm going. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight. He hauls off and hits me in the chest. And I just haul off and hit him right in the eye. And Phil just throws me out of practice. Uh, a lot of moments last night that go viral that people talk about. Well, one of the heroes last night, uh, one of the characters, Robin, people were talking about was the security guard who was gambling, essentially, with uh, Jordan before a game. They're just throwing quarters at the wall, and Jordan is trash-talking his security guard. Uh, but this is John Michael Wozniak. He was his personal uh, security guard there for many, many years. Just give you some more. Another look, uh, Robin, at MJ and just how competitive yeah. he was. He's throwing quarters and talking trash Woo. to a security guy. Woo. I uh, know <laughs> that that was MJ. Hey, it was really sweet, though, how they dedicated episode five in loving memory of Kobe Bryant. That was really that was really cool. Also, you know who we saw in that episode? Spike Lee. Huh? TJ, we're going to talk to the filmmaker. Yes. And the NBA, oh, he knows, he knows where you are right now. He knows the garden. Oh, he, the role that he played as Jordan became an icon. So we're going to talk to Spike in our next hour. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.